everyone. So, Osimo, did we have any mail? Yes. No. But my neighbor gave this to me. Oh, well, how nice. Let's see what we have here. And it's an invitation to Cassidy's birthday party. Well, that's great. The kids will be so excited. Thank you, Osimo. Well, I'm an amazingly capable humanoid robot. How oh, can I help you? Well, let's see. Um, my parents are coming over later because my husband and... I am going to go out. <laughs> uh -oh. Osimo, I totally forgot. I told my husband we'd call as soon as you got here. Let's do that now. Okay? Sorry, folks. It'll just take a minute. Hello. Hi, sweetie. Hi, honey. Guess who's here? Osimo. Uh-huh. Can I keep it? <laughs> <laughs> sure. Hello. Hi, Osimo. I'm coming home early from work today, so I'll pick up the kids. Oh, good. We are so excited. I know. So I'll see you in a little while. Oh, and don't forget, we're going out tonight, so make sure you remind your parents that they're babysitting, okay? I will. See ya. Bye, honey. Bye, Osimo. Bye-bye. See you in a bit. Well, Osimo, welcome to the family. Thank you. Real quick, though, I have got to remember to order a pizza for the kids so that my mom doesn't have to make her dinner when she gets me. I can do that later. Now, developing the world's most advanced humanoid robot that you see here didn't happen overnight. In fact, it took teams of Honda experts over 20 years to develop this incredible piece of technology. Experts in the fields of physics, anatomy, uh, mathematics, computer sciences, chemistry, and mechanical and electrical engineering. And they thought of everything. So check this out. Asimo, come this way, please. So, if I'm sitting down or in a wheelchair like my husband, then Osimo's camera eyes are about the same level as my eyes, which makes communication very easy. In fact, if you look at the screen there, you can see Osimo looking at me now. Hey, Osimo. Hello, Sarah. Osimo, would you please turn out to any friends here? Everybody, give a big wave and say hello to Osimo. Hello, everybody. You might be wondering why Osmo isn't on wheels or treads or something like that. Well, <laughs> Osmo was designed to help people and to be a helper in our world where you have to reach for things and pick things up, navigate along floors and sidewalks, or even climb a set of stairs. Well, what better design than a humanoid robot? One that has two arms and two legs. Hey, Osmo, how tall are you? I'm four feet and three inches tall. And that's the perfect height for turning lights on and off, or opening and closing doors, working at table surfaces, or, you know, just moving things around inside the house. And Osimo, how much do you weigh? I weigh 119 pounds. Okay, so let's see, we'll call that be in metric. If it's I'm 130 centimeters tall and weigh 54 kilograms. Okay, and how fast can you walk? I can walk about two miles per hour. And in metric, that would be? That would be about three kilometers per hour. Oh, great job, Osimo. <laughs> Thank you, Sarah. Now, in order to operate in our world, a robot must have the ability to walk like a human. And walking is really pretty complicated. Follow me on this. Each step that I take requires my brain to send countless signals at lightning speed through my nervous system to the, to the um, muscles, tendons, and ligaments in my legs, hips, arms, and shoulders, which all have to move in sync just for me to keep my balance. Cute. The really amazing thing is that Osmo does something very similar, only it uses sensors, motors, and computers to maintain its balance and walk like a human. Osmo also has the ability to sidestep, as you can see, <laughs> in a straight line or even on a curve, which is very useful in navigating through our household with all of its constantly changing obstacles. You know, Osmo, I think that particular move is going to come in really handy with my kids. Even more impressive, Osmo not only has the ability to walk forward, but Osmo can walk backward as well. You can see it. There you go. 
Uh -huh. Constantly adjusting its center of gravity with every step, just like us. In fact, Cosmo's balance is so good. Watch this. Cosmo, please balance on one foot, like this. Okay, well, Osmo makes it look easy, but it must continuously analyze data from all of its sensors and 34 separate servo motors. You know, Osmo, looks like there isn't anything you can't do. You can't fly. Yet. But I can play soccer. Yes, you can, and I bet we even have a ball here. Yep, looks like you get to show off a little bit. Alrighty, here we go. And hold on, don't kick it just yet. I'm going to make this official. <laughs> Use these as goalposts. All right, Osmo, go for it. Go! Good job, Osmo. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, Osmo, kicking that ball requires some very technologically advanced balance, stability, and coordination. And with your ability to understand voice commands and move effortlessly throughout your environment, it is really easy to see how valuable you're going to be helping us out around the house here. Hey guys! Hi oh, hey guys! Hey, is Osmo there? Uh huh. Hello. That is so cool. I know. Osmo, we'll be home in like five minutes. Oh yeah. Osmo, I told everyone in school they can come over and meet you. Okay, we'll I invite everyone in the neighborhood. They can't be here today. Yeah, okay, Osmo, you're a star. Okay. Bye, okay. Osmo. Bye, Osmo. I get you to focus for just. I know. Okay, come on, can I at least get a goodbye, Mom? How about, love you, Mom, see you later. Well, Osmo, looks like you're pretty popular with the kids. I would even say you're a celebrity around here. Mm -hmm. uh, my kids are talking about Osmo's website. It's full of videos that show all kinds of different things that Osmo can do. And oh, Osmo really can help out in a lot of different ways now. Let's see. Um, Osmo, would you please use your wireless networking capabilities to... Go online and get the weather forecast for tonight. Yes, I will go online. Great. My husband and I are going out for anniversary. <laughs> Partly cloudy with a high in the mid-60s. Good to know. I'll bring a sweater. Now, although Osmo's current role is as a helper in the home, someday it might be able to do jobs that are dangerous for humans like fighting fires or working in unhealthy environments like cleaning up toxic spills. But I'm not only designed to help, I can also have fun. I think I know just what you're talking about. Hey, would you all like to see Osmo dance? Uh, yeah? What do you say we show him, Osmo? You ready? Hit it! Did that cute little robot arrive? Yes, Osmo's right here. Oh, good. Well, we'll see you soon. Sounds Make sure our room is ready. Make sure our room is ready. Hi, Dad, I can hear you. I can hear you, Earl. <laughs> okay, honey, bye. Bye-bye, I'll see you in a little while. Oh, no, I turned this thing off, Earl. You remember, just, yeah, there you go. Yeah, my parents and technology are still trying to figure out how to get along. Did you get it? All right, see you in a bit. Come to think of it. This might be the first time my parents have actually volunteered to watch the kids. I wonder why. Anyway, if you'll excuse me for just a minute, I'm going to run on upstairs and see if I can actually... Awesome-o, would you do me a favor, please? Yes, Sarah. Would you please go upstairs and see if the guest room's ready for Mom and Dad? Of course. Great. Now, what we're about to witness is one of Osmo's most challenging maneuvers made possible by combining all of its onboard technology 
The ability to climb a set of stairs with smoothness and precision is the culmination of over two decades of research and development. To perform this feat, Osmo stops momentarily at the foot of the stairs and then adjusts its position by reading a mark on the floor using a sensor that's located in its torso. Are you ready, Osmo? I am ready. <laughs> All right, then, go for it. Now, with each step, Osmo must adapt and continuously counterbalance using all of its sensors and computing power to remain upright, adjusting all along the way. Ready to go, Osmo. And that is truly an historic step forward in human technological progress. All right, Osmo, would you please peek into the room on your right for me? Looks perfect. Thank you, Osimo. You're welcome. And if you thought the way up was hard, it takes even more balance and precision to make it back down. Whenever you're ready, Osimo. Now, once again, Osimo will locate the proper position by using the sensor in its torso. And then, once it detects the right position, it will send the stairs. Once again, continuously adjusting and counterbalancing as necessary all the way back down. Nice done. Thank you very much. Well, folks, you know, I don't think there's anything that can top that. So, if you'd like to learn more about Osimo, you can visit the website. It's osimo.honda.com. As for you, I think it's about time to get you ready to meet the kids. Excuse me. Yes? Please do not forget to order the pizza. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Thank you, Osimo. You're welcome. And I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> oh, it sounds like the kids are home, so Osimo, why don't you go ahead and say goodbye to all of our new friends here. Goodbye, everybody. And everybody, let's hear it one more time for Osimo.